During a time of extremes, white supremacy has been on the forefront of these extremities. Along with the political climate, white nationalism has seemed to become much more prevalent in our society. There's almost no common ground on this subject either. The book, Rising Out of Hatred, The Awakening of a Former White Nationalist, makes a great example out of a former white nationalist, Derek Black, who was able to evolve his ideologies through deep connections and friendships with diverse groups of people. Derek Black is the son and godson of former KKK Grand Wizards. The story discusses how he is able to change his own radical ideologies after being groomed since adolescence to believe in these white nationalist ideologies. By the time he's 19, he's notorious for his white nationalist talk show called Stormfront. Derek then decides to attend a liberal art college where he makes new connections with diverse groups of people. Because of these connections, he was better able to recognize their feelings and experiences that defy his own ideologies about them in the first place. Derek went through a radical awakening and all it took was some person-to-person -person connection. Because of Derek's changing views and beliefs, he's then isolated from his family. He's no longer allowed in his childhood home and the only communication he has with his father is through public disagreements. This behavior on both Derek and his father's side became much more prevalent during the 2016 election where Derek's dad and godfather spoke out in favor of white nationalism while Derek publicly spoke out against. So I think that the author did a great job of displaying Derek's story through his point of view and he also calls him out on his previous ideologies and assumptions about non-white, non-Christian, non-hetero type people. So personally this book did impact me a lot and it restored some faith in humanity for me. This book has helped me become more self-aware of how I treat others and how to look beyond assumptions. Humans are complex and are able to evolve and this book has taught me how to further evolve myself. So I would definitely recommend this book to every single person. I think it gives great insight into that to the extreme side of things and just shows how people can grow and evolve and don't have to be so stuck in their ways just because that's what they once knew. And I also think this would be a great book to have young people read so they are able to learn through experiences based on emotion, empathy, and real life connections versus the media or what is normalized around them. But that wraps up my book report. I'm Grace Milligan and thank you for watching.